and welcome to How to Cook Great Food. With thousands of recipes and millions of views, why not subscribe to our channel and join the family? Welcome back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com. If you haven't already, please click that button and subscribe to our channel. On the menu today, we're going to be making an Ethiopian dish of tubs. Well, I'm not actually making it. I've got Rahel in the kitchen. She's not been here for a while, so she's back, which is great. So we're making a, a lamb and mushroom tubs or fry. Rahel's going to cook this, and I'm going to interrupt with some English translations, which I hope are okay. Okay, so in the center there we've got some lamb, uh, just chopped nicely, no bone. Uh, to, the, to the left and right we've got onions and mushrooms. Below the onions we've got garlic and olive oil. You could add some ginger to this if you wanted as well. In the center bottom, tomatoes. And then on the right hand side there, as I'm looking at it, we've got kibbe, which is a spiced butter. Uh, there's a recipe for that you can find on the channel. Next to that, some rosemary. Obviously, we're going to add a little touch of salt and maybe some black pepper. Okay, so that was uh, olive oil in, not too much because we're going to add the butter as well later. In goes the lamb, salt, pepper and the dried rosemary. If you had fresh rosemary, you could add that later on. We're going to cook this on a kind of medium heat for about six minutes. Okay, so you can see the meat has sort of changed colour. Got quite a lot of moisture out of it, which we want to kind of dry it down a little bit, but don't worry about the moisture there at this stage. In goes the garlic and the onions. And also note, well, when generally people make tubs, the onions are cut in that fashion. They're not chopped, they're diced, they're kind of sliced, generally. We're going to cook this on the same heat for about another four minutes. We're going to stir it every now and then. <laughs> Okay, so really simply, in goes the mushrooms at this stage and we're going to fry them on the same heat for about three minutes. Okay, so we've now just started the process of adding the tomatoes. Now, that's a kind of an extra thing. If you wanted just the mushrooms before the tomatoes went in, you could just add the kibbeh or the butter 
and that would be considered to be tips. But if you want a little bit of sauce, which what I was after, we're going to put a little a few bits of tomato in, and she's going to cook that down for about four minutes. <laughs> Thank you so much. Bye. Right, we're done. So just at the end there, just added the kibbe or the spiced butter and some chili. That's about it. Hope you enjoy that. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Lots of love. I'm a Saganalo. With thousands of recipes and millions of views, why not subscribe to our channel and join the family?